You have a fair advantage over me. Let's see it. MLG4 here. Welcome back to another wonderful weekend. The show where we get to enjoy the beautiful sun that's starting to show. It's brightening my eyes. Okay, I was overreacting a little bit. It's not that bright out, but oh, oh never mind. Ah! Jeez, I swear my neighbors hate me at this point. I don't know. How do people stand me in doing these every single weekend? So, what are we doing this weekend? Well, this weekend I got a marriage to attend to. No, it's not me, I, I wish, but I'll never ever have a girlfriend ever again. So I'm gonna be going to a wedding. Hopefully I'll stop at some of the some of the food trucks that are at the Troy Fair. Since we can't have the Troy Fair this year, we can at least have the food stands. And so that will keep us at least for some social distancing. Hopefully we'll be able to stop there sometime this weekend. Man, do I like slurring a lot. Also, the water is worse than last week. Even yes, we have gotten rain. Yes, we have gotten thunderstorms, even severe weather, even damaging winds around here that has knocked down a few trees. But no, it's still not enough rain. <sighs> it's just every time we get rain, it's just enough. Not even enough. Okay, let's just start this wonderful weekend because I gotta get to gotta get to 3Ds. My life is boring, apparently. Well, I mean, I at least work some more but i really don't want to do anything tonight i guess and i'm just tired i don't know why but i just suddenly got tired <sighs> okay well i'll see you guys tomorrow where the weekend continues but, <sighs> I'm, I'm so tired all of a sudden why it just hit me like a wave why am i just so suddenly tired why Good morning everyone, hello. It's a beautiful, wonderful morning. And with barely any clouds in the sky, it's going to be a beautiful, beautiful day. And also not enough rain, but hopefully next week we get enough rain. We'll get too much rain probably now. We'll probably get too much rain for the rest of this year. Okay, what else is happening today? Well, let's, let's, let's find out. Now that I'm at an exquisite style for this wedding, we're gonna head over. We're gonna have some fun in the sun because it's gonna be an outdoor wedding. Yay! Let's go! We're here at the wedding. It's an outdoor event. Fully, fully outdoors. So I'm gonna roast today. Also, I don't know what I can record and who I can record and when I can record and why I can record because this is A family and B, this is kind of. No, you're good. You're good. Sorry. Yeah. We're gonna see how much I can cover today. We'll try our best. But if I can't, then I can't, of course. I always like to keep things at least a little privatized. But at the same time, I don't mind. I, don't, I like to bring things into a public light. We'll see what happens. Anyway, so it's time for some kissy kissy face. Something I'll never get in my life. Let's just face it, I'll never ever find love. Scott, would you please make these vows of consecration and commitment to Victoria? I, Scott, I, Scott. take you, Victoria. Take you, Victoria. To be, my wedded wife. to be my wedded wife. I will be a husband unto you. According to God's holy word. With God's help, I commit to nourish and cherish you. And support you through the challenges of life. My endeavor shall always be to make for us a home where love and peace abide. I will pray for you, encourage you, and prefer you before myself. I will love and respect you till death do us part. Of Almighty God, that you love, honor, and cherish one another all the days of your lives, that you faithfully fulfill the vows you have made this day, and that you regard them as sacred and holy for the rest of your lives. May you recognize and walk in the miracle that has taken place during this service. And may God's love be the essence of your relationship and his word be the guide by which you walk. God has a plan and a purpose for the two of you and you are now one in name and one in aim. And what God has joined together, 
let not man separate. Scott and Victoria, having heard your vows in the presence of God and these witnesses, I now pronounce you man and wife. Scott, you may kiss your bride. Well, the wedding went great. They said I do and everything was smooth and perfect. It was excellent. I've had rum and coke, so I just want to give you guys a heads up if I'm a little dreary than usual. By the way, I'm going to mention this right now. I don't promote any drinking of any sort for Wonderful Weekend. I, I do not promote it at all. Please not drink if you're underage and please drink responsibly if you are at the legal age of drinking. Just to clarify everything. It's time to have fun. It's time to boogie down and have a reception of a lifetime, I think. Maybe not, but we'll see how it goes. Well, we'll have fun. We'll definitely have fun. Delicious. I can't wait to eat. Come into your mouth and I guess eat me. You have a fair advantage over me. Let's see it. Close. Well, it's been fun having here and doing whatever we do here, and it's been fun and everything. So it's time for me to head home and time for me to leave. And man, I really hate when people play copyrighted music, but that's okay because it is a party and it is a wedding. So I'll see you guys back home. Well, that was tonight. I had a fun time and I had some good times. Fun times and good times. So I'll see you guys tomorrow where we'll wrap up the rest of this weekend. And I'll see you guys then. So let's go to it. I'm so tired right now. I'm sorry, I can't think. Good afternoon everyone, hello. Sorry, it's been a very draggy morning for us. And for me especially. I didn't really leave my bedroom until 11 a.m. <laughs> so there's, there's a plus. It's nice, it's sunny, it's a little toasty, but it won't stop us from whatever we're doing today. I'm not sure what we're doing today. Ooh, nice wind. <sighs> Hopefully it doesn't rain today. Or no, I want it to rain today because our river is ever going lower, even with the rain that we got last night. I don't understand. Why can't we just get enough rain just no, we're gonna get enough rain when it floods. That, that's when we're gonna get enough rain. When it's too much. <sighs> yeah, let's see what's happening. With some first raising and some talking and with some last minute changes and last minute plans and some persuasion, we're now heading to the Troy Fairgrounds where we're gonna be enjoying some of their foods over there. So let's head over there right now and let's dig in into some fair treats. That's all the way I could only put it. I didn't want to get dirty. <laughs> Okay, well, we're here now, and we're gonna get some food. We're gonna get some good food. Well, that was eventful for about 10 minutes. It was still good, that was great and all. Now, we're gonna be miniature golfing. Oops. Uh, what? Well, it looks like I'm ending this video here, so thank you guys for watching this wonderful weekend. And sorry I didn't record as much as I wanted to. Ish. Sort of. I've. Eh, it's, this is fun. So I gotta get, get to bed so I can get to doing my weekly things. So I'll see you guys in the next video. But hey, you know it's coming, so. Live life. Oh, <laughs>